94.7 QDR. Hey, it's Heather Davis and another edition of Furs Day. And I've got Samantha with the SPCA of Wake County and Jane. Let's look at this face. She's like a cartoon character. I love her face. Look at her coloring. Yeah, she has got character. Oh my gosh, she's so sweet. Caricature level cheeks. Yes, she does. <laughs> So nice. tell us what you know about her. So Jane is two years old. Um, uh -huh. She was picked up as a stray in Harney County okay. and ended up at the shelter there. So we transferred her over to the SPCA oh gosh. because she uh, she unfortunately has got heartworm disease. Oh so, no! Yeah, that's no good. So uh, but the good news is we're providing her full treatment. So good. It's gonna be a multiple month process, but we have a program called Foster to Adopt. So mm -hmm. um, we can treat her while she's in the process of being adopted. So she can okay. go home with a new family and she can get her whole heart treatment and she'll be good to go. She'll awesome. be a healthy girl. So and that's something now where they need kind of a calm-ish type house, correct? When it yeah. comes to heartworm treatment. So it's not, I mean, it's not gonna kill her. She She's getting treated and she'll be fine, but it does need to be at least for the first couple months, kind yeah. of a calmer house, so. Yeah, just kind of taking it easy. Because because uh, heartworms are can be you know pretty rough so yeah. just take it easy until her treatment's complete but then yeah she'll be good to go. Hey yeah Jane. so she uh, because she was living as a stray we don't know a whole lot about her background. Come uh -huh. here. So we're uh, can you sit? Oh, oh my good gosh, girl. good girl. Yes, you get both because you're so good. Because you're so good. Super sweet. She's like ready for anything. <laughs> she was really nervous when she first got there and then within like the first couple of days she's like you guys are all my new best friends. <laughs> So yeah, she's we love you. She loves everybody. Oh my gosh. Now, how much does she weigh? Just about. Uh, she's about 50, 50 pounds yep. or so. Yeah. Yeah. She's, she's a great size running. though. Mm -hmm. She's great size and she's, and she's solid. She's going to put, we're going to put a little weight on you though. We're going to put a little weight on you just because you need it. Because you need it. So what kind of house do we think we recommend for her? Well, because we, we're not really sure, obviously, a lot about her, and she's been out on the streets, so. Yeah, she's, she's uh, not in the town. She's got a little bit of energy. She's pretty playful. She's basically an overgrown puppy. Yeah. Uh, we don't know how she is with cats, yes. and because of her heartworms, we haven't been able to test her with other dogs because she doesn't uh -huh. need to stay calm right now. But mm -hmm. uh, you can always do a dog meet to see if she gets along with your dog. Just make sure it's a good fit before adopting. But uh, she's pretty easygoing. She likes just about everybody, so she'd probably fit in with most families. She's very curious. She loves to investigate the world, for sure, right? Yes. Right, right, right. <laughs> okay. If you are interested in Jane, we'll put all of her information below. Do you guys have any events going on for the holidays? Oh, well, no events at the moment. Uh -huh. um, we have a microchip clinic coming up this Saturday. Oh, great. Almost sold out. It's a $5 microchip clinic, which is a really good price. Oh, my God. That's amazing. Yes. Yes. If you have so. not microchipped your, your dog or cat, please do, because easiest way for them to come back to you is if they're microchips. So. 100%. Yeah. We will put that information below as well. Yeah. Thanks so okay. much for watching.